Well, there's the short term and then the intermediate term. I think that uh, we've been here before. You know, I think we've gone through cycles where we've come out of a credit cycle, evaluation cycle, an economic expansion cycle. Um, that was the case in 2001 and 2009. Uh, and now it's the case in, in 2023 where there really are no deals because the context is pretty complicated. Uh, and the uncertainty around the credit markets is not helping. And the prospect of the recession that you all have been talking about, I think, is a, is a clarity uh, for most investors that you need to withstand a big recession. Um, so buyers and sellers are not seeing it the same way. You know, I think there's a lot of uh, memories and nostalgia for 21 peak valuations, which, you know, they don't wear off very quickly. Um, and so I think it's pretty difficult for buyers and sellers to get together. That's the bad news for the short term. Uh, but in all those cycles in the past, it was the second or third year where the volume really took off. You know, it's where the credit market stabilized, where the recession, you know, was behind us. Uh, and I think in those markets, I think that's where you're going to see, you know, the, the deal business really grow in volume again. And where do the regional banks fit into that? We're about to get earnings from them. I know you talk to a lot of bank executives. Uh, are they going to have to go through a period of pushing away from the table when it comes to lending? to get these balance sheets shored up, and, and then how much of an impact are, are you modeling that that's going to have on the economy? You know, it's just, there's so many straws in this camel's back. Uh, you know, that was just the, the last one. Um, you know, I think the banks themselves, the big banks, were not lending. I think they had a difficult time going out on duration with committing huge capital to take privates or, or LBOs in general. Uh, the syndicated market was not working. Uh, the direct lenders were pulling back because they also saw some challenges with their flows. So, you know, the regional banks is just another another straw on that back. And, and so I think they are pulling back, especially for small businesses. Uh, we have a big venture portfolio. It's obviously going to impact uh, their liquidity relative to uh, the lending practices of, of a Silicon Valley bank. Um, so I think it's just another way that uh, I think markets and businesses will will suffer in, I think, what is the coming recession.